Hi everyone. So today we will understand the concept of transport system in SAP. So transport happened. What what is transport? First, let's understand that transport is a kind of bucket where you know when we the when, when the functional consultant do the configuration, all those configuration through some objects get stored in the transport request, and it's a kind of number. When let's say I created a company, it got stored in one transport. With that help, with the help of that transport, I can copy that configuration from one system to another system having under the same landscape. So that's the use of transport. So what happened in normal scenario? We do the configuration in development system. We make a note of the transport. With the help of those transport, the configuration is copied to the development to the quality server. Testing is done, and then the same transports are being copied to the production server. So that's the use of transport. The configuration is copied, and it's all shortly used by a functional consultant. Those who are involved in configurations, or those who are involved in custom developments. So we will see what transport is. I will do the, some configuration. Let's say I'll create a company. I save it. So here it was giving me this number by default. So what I'll do, I'll create my own number. So I'll say test transport. So my company will be saved in this particular transport. Now when I, if I want to see this transport. I have to go to transaction SE10. I have to put my user ID, and this is what I just created: test transport. This is I have just done. I have just created a company. So this is the object in my transport. And when we have to move the transport, we have to release from the first the source system. This is the source system. I put click this, and I will release this. Release. It is released now. And we have to go to the in the next system. We have to go to SCC one, and we can import this. We have a source system, source client. And we can import the transport. My source client was eight hundred, and I will see what is my transport number. So I will say start. has been this activity has to be done in cl next client 811 or whatever so that's how we can move the transport so this that's how we save into the transport first and then we copy into that transport thank you